You mentioned uh, over the weekend that, that you read the, the now infamous 32 words, and you said that <laughs> you wanted an apology. Can you talk about what you meant well, by that? Well, here's what I think is on the minds of most Americans. That statement did, did not strike me as particularly appropriate. As a matter of fact, I thought it was very inappropriate. She has a lot to celebrate. She's an accomplished woman, very qualified, extremely bright, but this was a prepared speech, and it's just not that paragraph, it's the whole speech. Uh, to say that her experiences, which are, are laudable, makes her better or wiser than a white guy like me is inappropriate. And if I would said that, I know what would have come my way. And I think she deserves a ch second chance. I don't know if I would have gotten one, but I'm willing to listen to her about that statement. And I'm not gonna base my whole decision on that statement, but I think it needs to be addressed, and quite frankly, I think it was inappropriate, and she should apologize, because it offended me. You, take it, you took it personally? Yeah, I mean, you know, I've been knocked around, but there are people in, in, in America that have gone through a far worse than I have as individuals and as groups, and to say that those experiences make one better, a person better than someone else, is just not what you want in a judge. She, she's gotta realize that when she gave that speech, People are not looking at her as a political activist, they're looking at her as a sitting judge. It would be one thing for a politically involved person to say that, but I want my judge, if I find myself in court, I want to believe that that judge is going to fairly evaluate me, and quite frankly, she's got to convince me that if I found myself in litigation with a Latino woman, that I'd get a fair shake. You think you'll get an apology tomorrow? I'll leave that up to her.